Neptune is the eighth and the most distant planet in the solar system and is a mysterious dark world because of its colossal distance from the sun. It has only ever been visited by the Voyager 2 spacecraft back in 1989 which captured the first close-up images of the Neptunian system. Neptune's atmosphere is mostly made up of hydrogen and helium but its beautiful blue color comes from methane and other components in the upper atmosphere which absorb the red light and reflect it as a magnificent vivid blue. So let's jump into a science fiction spacesuit and dive directly into this strange world to see what lurks deep below Neptune's mysterious clouds. As we fall towards Neptune, we would have an incredible view of the planet's immense storms raging below us. We would be descending at a similar speed to if we were falling towards the Earth as Neptune's gravity is only 14% stronger than our own planet Earth. Because we are so far away from the Sun, very little light reaches this distant planet of the solar system, resembling a dim twilight back on Earth. We would first fall through a high white cirrus clouds made of methane ice crystals at about 0.5 atmospheric pressure which is half the atmospheric pressure at sea level on Earth. At this altitude it is incredibly cold, dropping to below minus 200 degrees Celsius around 30 miles down, we would enter into the ammonia and hydrogen sulfate cloud decks at about 5 atmospheres. Here the clouds move faster than the speed of sound on Earth as Neptune experiences the fastest wind in the solar system which reach speeds of up to 1,500 miles per hour. But because of our science fiction spacesuit, let's assume we are kept steady and continue on our descent. Because of Neptune's thick clouds and distance from the sun, no light can penetrate this deep and we would find ourselves in a pitch black, cold, lonely environment with violent winds whipping past us. After falling for a long time we would be 100 miles into the Neptune when huge flashes of lightning illuminate our dark surroundings, revealing towering white water ice clouds that are causing rumbling thunderstorms to occur. After a very long time of sinking we would be around 4,000 miles into the Neptune and within the planet's mysterious mantle layer. Here our suits would have to withstand pressures greater than 10,000 atmospheres and the increasing temperatures higher than 4,000 degrees Celsius. This strange superheated layer is composed of water, methane, and ammonia ices that behaves as a hot dense fluid under immense pressure. Because of these extreme pressures, carbon atoms might also crystallize and form diamonds. As we descend ever closer towards Neptune's core, these diamonds would rain down around us like glittering hailstones as they slowly sink through the liquid mantle. After a long time of sinking through this thick region with pressures and temperatures continuing to drastically increase our adventure would come to an end. As no suit can survive in that deadly situation, but maybe a satellite can. Hope you liked the video do like and subscribe. Universe Science